What's up, it's Coach J Pro, and we're back with another round of Reflex Bang. Bag Bang. Workouts. Okay, let's go. Okay, let it be known. I'm working hard when I ain't on the phone. This ain't a hunt, this ain't a phone. Grind never stopping, I'm keeping it cold. Unlocking the door with the holy key. You're supposed to be this close to me, and hopefully, you understand GOD. Maybe this cold, and I'm talking like no degrees. Today we have a 10 minute reflex bag workout for balance and stability. It's gonna be great for all levels and all you need are boxing gloves and a reflex cobra bag. Today I'm using my favorite mid-level bag. It's the Nista Cobra bag by Valley Sports. If you like this bag, I'm gonna put a discount link in the description. Other than that, you know what time it is. Throw those boxing gloves on. We're gonna jump right into the first round. So when I'm talking about balance and stability, I'm referring to actual physical balance, which is a key component of effective boxing technique. But I'm also talking about mental balance because we know the two go hand in hand. First, we're gonna approach our bag. We're gonna jump in around one with a flow one, two. This is our light continuous pace. Start to get those arms warmed up. So there's nothing unique about this workout. The only way that you are gonna improve your balance is if you embrace the approach. So after we go through this warm up round, we're pretty much working combinations all the way through. And the only thing I want you to focus on is your balance. We're gonna stay with this flow one, two for another 30 seconds. So that means we don't wanna be leaning forward too much or backwards when we punch. We don't want our feet to be shuffling too much. We're not worried about speed or power or timing. The only thing I want you to think about is your physical balance and a one track mindset. Just focusing on getting into the rhythm with your back. First combination of the day, it's gonna be a one, two, five. Jab, cross, lead, uppercut. Only thing we're working on is our balance. So you can strike and then move, or if you're new, you can just work this combo in place. Nice and relaxed, I'm just focused on my balance here. I'm nice and still when I'm punching. And time. So if you're subscribed to this channel, you're gonna see that we're gonna have more uh, workouts like this every week that are singularly focused. Because you can't do it all at once. You can't get speed, power, strength, balance, all these different things. You gotta really break it down. So we're gonna go back to that one, two, five for 30 seconds. And the only thing I'm thinking about here is my balance. I'm not worried about my speed. I don't want to be leaning too far in any direction. I'm nice and balanced. Now we're going to switch it to a one, two, six. So jab, cross, rear uppercut now. So we don't want our feet to be shuffling too much. So we want to be planted and balanced. Now for the last minute, we're going to alternate. So we're going to go one, two, five, and then a one, two, six. So we're just putting those two combos together. What? 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 Speaking of balance. See, I could have gotten really frustrated there. Restarted this whole workout. 
but I'm not gonna let the small stuff affect me. I'm just gonna roll with it. That's what it's all about. <clears throat> it's putting the physical and the mental together. 15 seconds. One more. And time. You want to figure out what this exercise means to you. How can you be more balanced when you go through these rounds? It's going to be different for everyone. Some people might have the happy feet. You're going to force yourself to relax your footwork a little bit. Other people might be their lean. We're going to work a five, six for 30 seconds. Lead uppercut, rear uppercut. I don't care about speed. I don't care about power. Just balance. This. Okay, now we're gonna add a jab, a double jab at the end. Five, six, one, one. Last minute, we're gonna add a two. So our combo is five, six, one, one, two. Five, six, one, one, two. Focus on when you're hitting your bag and where. You want to hit it right when it's in the center, and I want a nice clean strike going right down the center line. Five, six, one, one, two. One more. And time. Okay, this is probably gonna be the most challenging round of the workout because we're gonna bring hooks into the mix here. And we know how difficult hooks can be on a moving target like a reflex back. So just take your time, find your balance. We're gonna open up working a three, three for 30 seconds. Just a double lead hook. This, this. Try to catch me this, this. Once that timing starts to come together, it is so satisfying. This, this. So I hope you stick with it, because if you're brand new and you're feeling lost, trust me, I've been there. Just stick with it. This, this. Now we're gonna switch it. We're gonna work that four, four. This is a great test of balance here because if you miss, are you tumbling over or are you staying in place? This. What? What? This. 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 What? What? Last minute, we're gonna work a combination now. Hold reliable. One, two, three. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Lead hook. This. What? What? This. 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 A. A. What? What? This. What? What? This. Oh yeah, we're still sweating. This. What? What? 15 seconds here. His. What? What? His. What? A. One more. His. 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 And time. Uh, 
All right, are we feeling that inner calm, that inner balance? I wonder what's harder exercise, focusing on your actual physical form or the mental balance? It's tough to say. We're gonna finish with a freestyle round. First minute, anything you want here. Nice and light, nice and balanced. If you have some experience, try to throw some combos and move all around your bag. Slow it down though so you can find your balance. If you're new, just stand right in place. This is harder than it looks. Staying balanced when you're working a heavy bag is hard. This takes it to a whole nother level. Now we're gonna work in some call outs. So you continue your freestyle, but if I say two, you stop in place and give me a nice firm two, and then right back to your freestyle. Hish, hish. One, hish. one, hish. one, two, hish, hish. don't wait for me. Keep freestyling. Hey. 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 One more. Ish. Ish. One, one, two. Ish. 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 Six. Ish. Six. Ish. Six. Ish. Six, two. Ish. 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 One, three. Ish. Two. Ish. One. Ish. Two, one, hiss, hiss, and a one, two, three to end it. Hiss, 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 and time. Woo! Remember, there's no such thing as overnight mastery. Everyone wants to come in and dominate their speed and power and their form and their slips and their footwork. No way, it's way too much. You gotta break it down and just get a little bit better in each area week by week. So hopefully this one helped with your balance. And until next time, I'll see you again real soon. Ish, 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 what, what, what? Ish, 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 ish.